Welcome to the second Detective Stories. This one is about Anna. Uh, if you want to see my original playthrough, there's a link in the description below. Now this video, guys, is just a straight how-to video. Uh, if you're trying to find all the clues um, for this level, you can come over here, come through this door, go through this door, and then jump up on these pipes right here. Boop, boop, like this. And then you can find a bunch of clues in here. Uh, no, I'm not gonna... Uh, this, the purpose of this video isn't to go through all the clues or the storyline or anything like that. It's really just to give you the straight up answers um, so that you can get through the map. So this is where you come if you're trying to find all of the clues that you'll need. Basically, there's a, there's a bunch of clues at the, in the first level that you'll need later on. Um, but then you're gonna come over here to the end investigation and open this door. Now I should remind you guys to support Wirt Andrew in the item shop. He is seriously like one of the best map makers in the whole world and definitely show him some love. Okay, so first did Anna panic and leave her car as a result? Uh, no, she did not. She did not panic. Uh, then where did Anna go? She went to a hideout. All right, so we've, we've learned all of that in that first area. Um, this is also a good time to remind you to subscribe and turn on notifications if you're new. Where should I investigate next? We're going to the country house. Um, we do uh, awesome creative maps every day on the channel, whether it's our own maps or someone else's or featured maps. Uh, we do a lot on the channel. Okay, now, uh, in here you're going to find a special little button. You, if you hit that, it's going to open up a wall right here which will give you a lot of new clues and things you'll need to know later on in the map. So this is where you come if you want to learn all of that stuff. Okay, so now we're gonna go up to end investigation right up here. Um, and then we're gonna go to our first question. Did Anna disappear willingly? Yes, she did. The plot thickens, Mr. Twist. Was Anna involved in Isabel's disappearance? Yes, she was. Oh, Anna, you dirty dog. Oh, there is so many awesome like things. Make sure you read all the stuff. Where should I investigate next? Okay, so we're gonna go to Compton Road. So that's back to the beginning uh, because earlier it said something like, oh, there's a button under the table that you may have missed earlier. So we're going back to Compton Road um, to find the button that we missed. Remember this place? So we're back here. We're gonna jump over and then we're gonna go over here and find there's not a button but you just got to stand here for a bit and then that will open and then this is where we're starting to get into some like puzzles and stuff so this is the room with all of the air vents what you want to do is come over here and there is a tv screen here that says disable blue power line and enable green so hit that and there is no feedback there's nothing that's like beep, beep. I wish there was a little beep, but there's not. Um, but uh, then we're gonna come over here. This vent was on originally. And now we're gonna come over here and then push this one. This which turns off the red. Um, and then we're just gonna come back over here to the beginning where there's this red light. And then we'll hit this one like that. And then it turns the red back on. But then we can now come back over here uh, to, oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. I'm sorry, we're going to come back this way and now we can turn on this one and which opens it up this way. So now we can get back here. Hopefully that made sense. I hope I didn't confuse you. <laughs> I'm sorry if I did. All right, so the air vents are interesting. There's buttons on the sides of the air vents. Oh no, <laughs> I died. That's one life down. Okay, so be careful when you're coming back over the vent because uh, you will, you might die like I just did. Uh, <laughs> All right, so now we've got air vents. We're gonna go up and over. If I can actually get over, this is slightly embarrassing. Now we can turn this one on. And what we need to do is actually go back down to turn the air vent back on. And now we can come back over here. Let's avoid the trap again. There we go. All right, and now we're gonna go up and this air vent is now on again. All right, now we're in, we're coming up to the hard puzzles. Um, it took a while. So this is like a big maze here of doors and you can drop down and all this stuff and you'll find uh, there's these four words uh, in this maze somewhere. So there's malt, brandy, jockey, and graphy. 
and they there are different things associated so malt was left brandly is right jockey is straight and graphy is drop down too so we're gonna go left straight here and then drop down two so we're gonna drop down here so just be careful when you're dropping down that you don't like miss it so we're just gonna kind of like aim for the corners there you go and then you'll get here to the next puzzle now this one's an interesting puzzle um it's got a bunch of riddles here so the first one is i have two hands a round face i always run but stay in place what am i that's a clock that's a pretty easy one but you got to come over to the clock and hit the button so we're gonna hit e on that and then this says we are 30 men and two women dressed in black and white we can fight for hours without using hands what are we so that's a chess board which is right here and you'll see the button right on the back side right there now this one's confusing i belong to you yet i am used more by others what am I? Um, it's this piece of wood here, and I still don't really understand the, the riddle, but it's right here. Hit that button. And then this one says, I have no eyes yet. I can see forever. I create memories even though I cannot remember. What am I? So it's a camera. There's a camera right here, and there's a button on the side of the camera, which unlocks the door. And that's that whole puzzle. So I, uh, I have a confession to make. I actually died the first time I played through it. Um, I didn't make it because I couldn't find that stupid board. I just didn't understand the, the riddle and I still don't really understand. Maybe it's because, you know, you like you build a bridge out of it or something. I, I don't know. Okay, so the final trivia quiz. This is for all the marbles. If you get it wrong, you die. Okay, so what is Anna's favorite color? It's blue. You learn that by searching the clues in the, the country road. Uh, or not the country road, the country house. Uh, when was Anna born? Uh, so it's 1962. You can learn that by going to the the notes at the beginning where it says she's 36 and it is 1998. So that's just some simple math. And she was born in 1962. And now for the, the final question. Now, there are a couple of endings to this. And if you choose right, you get one ending. If you choose left, you get another. So the right one would be if you hit this button, it'll blow up some stuff over there and you'll get that ending but that's like kind of the wrong ending that's like the ending that you lose on versus this is the ending you win on you're gonna save the pillar because anna at, right at this point anna is you're thinking the bad guy is what's going on um now we're coming down here and we're just uh, this is more of storyline stuff i feel like all of the hard stuff is pretty much over although there is one little area i want to show you um, it's a little bit of a secret, um, but you have to be careful with it. Oh wait, here's the question. Um, I should s search for a liquor store nearby. I should search for fingerprints. We're going to the liquor store. I forgot about this whole spot. But there's just a little bit more of like the actual puzzles. And so in here, what you're gonna do is you're gonna look at the registers and you're gonna find the one that has the 511, 5511, and it's talking about the Doritos, or whatever it's called, it's the gin. And there's some questions up here. So here we are, let's go get the questions. All right, uh, so this is the, she bought gin, she's an alcoholic, and then she, and then it's like, what was the card number? And it ended in 5511, remember that. I got that wrong the first time. Well, actually, I got the number right, but I went the wrong direction just for because I'm an idiot. But that's uh, that's how it goes sometimes. All right, so this is the office where it says, oh, we're all done, and then something special happens up here because you're starting to, like, you know, this is the final verdict and all this stuff, and then something... So right here is where this is going to blow up. Oh, let's see if I can trigger this without falling. Oh, dang it. I fell shoot so there is a little like secret room over there that says shout out to mustard plays and other awesome people which is awesome i don't know how to not bl blow that up though i guess ah whatever um okay so now we're gonna move down here to 17th avenue where uh this is where you start to realize anna wasn't the bad guy there's still someone else mr twist and it alludes to a third map where we will finally take on Mr. Twist himself in Detective Stories number three. To be continued. I'm so excited to play the map, guys. These maps are so cool. You hit this to end the game. 
that's it so that's how you get through the map hopefully this helped i know it can be these these maps can be challenging but they're just super cool the story is just really intriguing can't wait to see the next one shout out to Word andrew for an amazing map and uh all right guys that's it for me i hope you have an awesome day